Yeah. Today we're off to Rancho, Texas. We're just getting ready in the room. Gonna quickly go down and have a little bit of breakfast. Although it's tragic. It's a bit tragic. <laughs> um, so we're gonna go down and have breakfast uh, quickly and then shoot out to Rancho, Texas. So we'll see you there. So we've just arrived in the car park in the zoo. Yeah. We're having a look around. There's a lot of um, construction going on. So uh, we didn't know if it was open or not, but it is open. Hopefully. Yeah. Let me turn it round. I'll show you. So that's what we can see, like lots of different, I don't know, what is it, like pipe work and stuff. Yeah. I don't know what they're doing, but yeah, this is a... Uh, well, we'll show you the entrance when we get out, but it, uh... All right, so we've arrived here at Rancho Texas. We've just come into the shop. Uh, it's, it's quite confusing when you get here. There's two different entrances. Um, you can go either way because uh, I think they're building the entrance itself. As you saw when we come in the car park, it's a little bit under construction so sort of thing. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's get in and show you. So eventually, I found something behind. A tree. Do you want to come and see it, guys? Yeah. All right, let's go and see it. What is it? A Komodo dragon. Look at him. Whoa! Don't get too close, Jack. It might bite you. Look, look at that <laughs> oh my God! Look, a buffalo. Right. Oh, look, and a baby buffalo. Whoa! <laughs> so cool, isn't it? Whoa! Okay, so immediately when you come through the entrance at Rancho Texas, um, there is a big swimming pool and like a splash area. Let me show you. That's the best way to explain it. Look at this. How good does that look? It's the big buffalo and the little buffalo again. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah. So you've got some beds. I bet you, I bet you it's heated as well. Yeah, it's, it, I don't know, it feels like... Um, look, the bucket. Look at the bucket. It feels a bit warmer here. I don't know. Do you think so? Because the, it's heated. There's less wind. Because we're, we're like surrounded by fencing and stuff, maybe. But yeah, that looks really cool. Where's the animals? Oh, we're going to go see some animals, but there's also these these massive water slides. Look. They're doing a so Ah, okay. Let's have a look. Oh, that looks like that would be so cool. How good is that? So over here, looks like they've got some toilets. Uh, then over here. Looks like it's a restaurant. So I've been told that there's lots of different restaurants around the park that you can enjoy. Cantina de Lupita. Don't know if I absolutely bash that name, but there we go. So what kind of stuff's on the menu? Let's have a look. This looks pretty cool. So obviously the theming is country and western. So these are the prices. I can get the prices on the camera there. So you've got pizza, an eight, a margarita pizza, eight euros. That's pretty good. Yeah, hamburger and chips, seven euros, not too bad. Chicken of well, falafel. So there's vegetarian options. All sorts of different things. So later on, we're probably going to eat some lunch. So we'll show you what we get and um, we'll tell you how much it was. Right, so first thing we've seen are some toucans. So there's one up there, just chilling out. Let's see if we can zoom in a bit. Yeah, look, one is look at the colours on them. Look, Amazing. Let's put his head to the side like Charlie does. Noah look. does, sorry. <laughs> and there's one down there. Eating. Quite a nice uh, environment from there, nice big environment. Yeah, loads of parrots and stuff down there. Yeah. 
I don't know what way you want to go. What way do you want to go, So, Do you think go around that way first? And I think it goes around a big circle. I'm not sure. There's a map just there. Yeah. Just in case it doesn't. Okay. Coming in. We're going this way first. So let's take a look. Yeah, McCall. Look. Ah, oh, look, that's like um, the one in the film, isn't it? Yeah. In Rio. Nigel. That one. <laughs> yeah, he's a cockatoo. A cockatoo, that's it. Whoa. They look very colourful, don't they? What kind of birds are these? Wow, lots of different colours. So what are they called? They're called Crimson Rosella. Wow. Oh no, they're not. They're called. It's a rainbow lorikeet. Rainbow. That's what that is. It's a rainbow lorikeet. They're yeah, really cool. I've never seen them before. And you see, right here, that's where his talents were. You see those big talents? <laughs> Their talents look Hello. very village. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Over here, it looks like it's the sea lions. Uh. So that's the exit of the sea lion. So it's this way, boys. So there's a little map so you can sort of see how big it is. Uh, yeah, so we're by the sea lions. Yeah, so it's just all really big, I guess. Just have to go round it. Ah, uh, so this is the entrance. Bit. All right, okay. So they also actually, while I'm here, they do country and western nights and, like I think I mentioned before, they do 50% um, off returns, but you have to book while you're here. Um, but yeah, they do country and western nights as well. Right. Right, so it turns out we actually came through the uh, exit and then as we went back through there, past the birds that was the entrance so like I said when you come in it's asked about it you can go in either way but let's carry on we'll go through the reptile house so when we come in here there's massive iguanas look at this one he's big isn't he look, look at that can you see that guys Yeah, it can get up to 48 kilograms. That's pretty big, isn't it? Oh, there's another one down here, look. Another big one. Yep, that's even... Can you see that? That's a little shot. Snakes in the water. Not snakes on a plane, snakes on the water. Where is he? Oh, he's down here, look. With Charlie. Whoa, Charlie, look at that. Is it an anaconda? You wouldn't think you get them in the Canaries, but you do, don't you? Yeah, everywhere. <laughs> no, nothing. Well, no big ones that can get you. Hang on, Jack's got lots and lots of stuff. Like, I was thinking, hey, that's a water snake. Like, they eat, like, goblins, you know? So, these guys only feed goblin fish to this guy. Right, okay. You know? Alligator snapping turtle. Show us then. It is actually. Look at Whoa. that alligator That is massive. You wouldn't want to, you wouldn't want that to catch you, would you? Is it alive? <laughs> it looks <Yes>. like dead. <laughs> it is alive. What? What's, what's, what's up here then? Oh, what's here? Look, a gila monster. Whoa. Look at these. Do you want me to lift you up, Charlie? Look. So you can see. Look at that. So, moving down from the waterfall, we got snakes. <laughs> I don't know what that is. What do you reckon that is, Jack? I think that's a python. A little baby python in there. Yeah. Oh, there's giant turtles at the back. Well, turtles, anyway. I don't know if they're giant. Oh, what you found, Charlie? Um, oh, 
Oh, here they are. Charlie, look, come and have a look. Turtles. Hello. Hello, turtles. Look, you can see this one head. <laughs> oh, look at that big snake. I'll lift you up in a sec, Charlie, and I'll show you. Wow, now that is a big snake. Let's zoom in. That's a big python, actually. Oh, did you see that? That's about to attack. That's a big snake. My friend told me you have now found oh, little babies. Baby. Yeah, yeah, no, I did see them, yeah. Hello. Hello. Would you want to see them? <laughs> Would you want to see them? They're in there. You would want li those little guys, wouldn't you? You would want li those little guys. So then they've got giant turtles, look at that. Absolutely massive. <laughs> so they've got the ultimate dragon or lizard. It's the Komodo dragon. Take a look at this. Look at how big it is. It's just sunning himself in the sun, look. Just chilling out. But that is massive. How heavy do they get, Jack? Look, up to 166 kilos. That is big. And look at how look at the size of that monster. Right, so you see that Komodo dragon is 166 kilos. I found his wife and she's about 122 kilos. So this one probably weighs about the same as me. It's solid muscle. Take a look at this. So you can see there, Sophie's standing next to it and how big it is. Massive. It's incredible. <laughs> what you found, Charlie? If I lay down next to it, I think it's... Oh, well, we can see it again from this angle. Look, massive. Yeah, look at that. Oh my god. There's a rooster. Keeps crowing. Cock a doodle doo. There he goes. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's cool. So there's meant to be a lynx in here. There's no even, there's not even a little. Um, like a shelter or anything, so maybe there is, but you just can't see it. Like it goes behind a rock or something, and then goes in. Oh yeah, that's inside. it. So yeah. So okay. So we can come on this bit and then go back in. So it's indoors maybe. at the minute. Yeah. Okay. So apparently, in 1731, the original inhabitants of Texas, but some of them were Canarian and they actually fought in the Battle of the Anima. Never knew that. So apparently there's a white tiger in here. Oh yeah, look at that. Wow. There's all them. There's the pack in there. <laughs> How good's that? Look at that. Yeah. I, yeah. I think he's bored though, isn't he? Because yeah, he's pacing backwards yeah. and forwards. Yeah. Need to stimulate him a bit more, I think. Yeah. It's a really cool enclosure to look at, but not, not much space. Big. But then not what's around there. Yeah, it goes around there a little bit, but yeah. Yes, yeah, so he was always there. Look, so back we were back at where the lynx was. Um, I'll zoom in, and he's just chilling out on the rock. Yeah, look. No climbing. Watch the moment of realization when she can see the animal. You see him? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Keeping the gardens nice and clean. I can smell. Animal poo. <laughs> you smell animals. Farm animals. Farm animals. Goats. Something like that. Ah, I spy with my little eye. Something beginning with bison. Bison. Look, boys. Oh my goodness! I found an armadillo. Did you? 
Look at these bison. Do you reckon that's a real tree? I don't know, it's like a root of, of a tree and how big it would be. I don't think it's real though. Or is it? No. It's not real. It's pretty cool. Look! Look at that! Look! Yeah, bison! Oh my goodness! Look! There's obviously like some sort of falconry display. Gonna be on a little bit later. There's all these birds sitting here, look. So, and there's like a stadium there as well. Or like, not a stadium, what do you call it? Like a half, I don't know, you see what you see. But yeah, might catch that later. Big old thing, isn't it? Big old smelly things, isn't they? Yeah, just look at the hoop. <laughs> so what you, what you can do here at Rancho Texas is you can go on a little kayak and um, like a little paddling adventure. Let me show you. So it's three euros um, each and it's seven years and over and one person per canoe. I would do it, but obviously they only let one person on and I'm probably too big. So you get to go all around there. And then you get to go up, up that little pathway and it goes all the way around. And then it comes out and down over here. Not a bad little thing, it's only three euros. Obviously Jack's only five so he can't do it. Otherwise we'd let him do it, but yeah, worth knowing. Now I promise I don't really make a habit of this, filming in toilet. But I just wanted to show you something. When you come into this toilet at the entrance of the park, you get to see the parrots. It's literally right in where the parrots are. So it's really interesting. <laughs> Tell me about it, Soph. So I ordered margarita pizza, ham and cheese baguette, yeah. chicken nuggets and chips, one yeah. beer, um, orange. Orange juice. Yeah, is it a juice? I don't know what Yeah, it is. something like that, yeah. And um, a Fanta. And 30, a Fanta. Uh, 30 euros. 30 euros. There's the bill just there. It's lemon. You can see. Well, so, that's not bad really, is it? It's not bad. I just noticed they've got, um, you know, like Calippos. Yeah. But they're um, cocktail ones. Really? Yeah, cocktail Calippos. Whoa, things. you fancy one of them, didn't you? Oh, well yeah, you do. We might have to get one of them, eh, so. Yeah, not a bad view here, sitting here in the restaurant uh, that we showed you at the start. Yeah. So there's the pool just there. Just so makes me want to go to Typhoon Lagoon. Makes you what? Makes me want to go to Typhoon Lagoon. <laughs> oh, in Florida, yeah, it reminds you of it, doesn't it? <gasps> Is that, there's a pool over there as well. Do you want to go and have a look? Oh, yeah, have a look at the set. Oh, you want me to take you? Yeah, go on. Okay, I'll take you over there. So that little buzzer's going to go off, and there's a little window there, and then you collect your food. Great for the sun's coming out. It's been really cloudy. Oh, so it's um, obviously you've got your sun loungers there. Nice and bright. This is just where all the flumes are. All the slides. Is that um? I know there's a lazy river, so because there's like uh, the rings. So I don't know whether that's just a pool that you go in. Um. And then obviously you've got all your, your flumes and stuff. It's quite a nice little area. I bet in the summer it's going to be ramoed. Yeah, it looks very tidy. Very, the pools look lovely and clean. Some shade as well. So we've got to worry about brollies, but they've got the um, sails up there. Plenty of beds, there's loads stacked up. That's a nice little shaded area if you've got little ones. Or if you just don't want to sit in the sun and burn. Um, yeah. It's really warm now, the sun's coming out, it's lovely. We've had pure cloud for the last two or three days. Just a blanket of grey and it's been really windy. Yeah, Charlie's got a thing at the minute where if I'm out of his sight, he has a meltdown. He wants me to be in his pocket. How dare you move? I don't know whether we'll have a little uh, test of the water, see how warm it is, but we should have brought our swimming stuff because we didn't think it was going to be warm today. 
because it's not been very warm. Um, as I say, it's been really windy and very cloudy, so we didn't bring our swim stuff, but now we're regretting it. Right, so this is the food that's just come out. That's the size of the margarita pizza, eight euros. That's not bad, that is it? Yes, Chicken nuggets, that's a good portion. I think that's quite reasonable. And there's the old uh, ham and cheese baguette. That's pretty good size. That's a fiver. That's a bit ropey for a fiver. But, but there we go. That's not bad though. Eight euros. Not bad, not bad. Right, so we found the crocodiles slash alligators. Um, I think they are crocodiles, aren't they? Yeah, but they're not alligators. What are they? I'm just saying that they might be something. It just says they're potentially dangerous. <laughs> Potentially dangerous. Yeah. Looks like there's a bit of construction going on here. Looks like they're expanding little areas. So I think that's going to be like a new entrance or something like that, maybe. But definitely the sun's coming out. Weather's definitely improving. Just underneath this tree at the minute, with all this Spanish moss on it, it's amazing. Yeah, just been looking at some rabbits. Thank you, Soph. Yeah, I've just seen if um, as they get in there, is that a door or anything? No, they just chuck them in. Just, no, but how do you get, if they get in? They just chuck them in. So how do you get in to feed them? Oh yeah, just chuck the food in. Don't think I've ever been as close to a flock of flamingos. I know, what do they call it? Oh, what's the, what do they call a group of flamingos? A flamboyance. A flamboyance of flamingos. Did you know that, Soph? Um, flamboyance? I think we learned that at Loro Park, didn't we? Uh, might have been. Or, or, or at Animal Kingdom. <laughs> it's a lovely little, uh, like, not petting zoo, but like little animals and stuff. Nice little environments and that everywhere. Lots of shade for them. Yeah, loads of shade. Obviously, it's lovely and cool under this tree. Just chewing away. You enjoying it, Jack? It's good, isn't it? I'm also very goats. There we go. Bird of goats. They're like little goats, aren't they? Boys, there's a big horse here, look. Come and see this big horse. It's like um It's like a Dalmatian, but it's a horse. <laughs> yeah, look, look. A big horse. Oh look, there's a man sitting there, look. He's gonna get ya. <laughs> nah, he's not gonna get ya. Yeah. Right, um, we need to go down that way to find the dolphins. Big holes though. So we've made it up to the dolphins. It is a bit of a long walk actually, wouldn't it? So nice walk. Nice walk, all, Brisk all the trees and all the, you know, bits and pieces. But now we're going to go have a look. And are you ready, guys? Are you ready, are you guys? Ready? Wow. What's that? It's meant to be a dolphin. Oh, okay. It's a big old dolphin. Right, we're in the caves. Oh, look. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking through the camera so I can see. <laughs> Oh. 
Yes, the volcano. Look, boys. Oh, volcano. Don't touch it. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> See, I've got here a little bit early, but only like five minutes. Because just don't know how busy it's going to be. Oh, look at this! <laughs> I can't see where do we go. Oh, look, what's over here? scared of darling is that is that real or is it a video it is isn't it where are you I can't see you <laughs> I want to get out all right Jack don't worry get out. it's nothing to be scared of oh wow look projection yeah how cool is that yeah This is really cool, isn't it? I could not see a thing back there. Don't know. Oh yeah, look what they look like on the inside. Cave. Whoa, how cool is that? Like a big 3D earth. Oh, I don't know if they've, they've got correct representation there. Is it flat or is it round? Oh, let me know in the comments. <laughs> Oh, crazy. Right, anyway. Oh, look, it's like eels and whales and stuff. Look. Little projection. No, not in the dolphins yet. A little video about garbage being responsible. Must be responsible with our rubbish, eh? Yeah, and we don't want all the dolphins. So I'm hoping this actually leads to the dolphins. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, it's just yeah, like. We used to have a dog control, but uh, now it's gone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, now now but here's a screen. What, a representation of what it would have looked like, but it doesn't look like anymore. Oh yeah, no, we're still entering it. Ah, oh. it's fancy. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. There's still more information. There's loads of information, oh, isn't there? Hey. So I guess peak season or whatever, this would oh, be absolutely ramo. Here we go, look. So Grandad thought there's no sharks, but it is, it turns out there are. So you get blue sharks, school shark, ha smooth hammerhead sharks. Yeah. And look, what's that? Birds. What's that? Bride's whale. Yeah, we've seen them jumping, didn't we? All these different dolphins, look. Whoa, I hope that's, Get lots I of different. They had on that side. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Well. Oh, so this is us now. Oh, it looks a pretty cool arena, doesn't it? Look at that. Oh my goodness, I can't wait to see this hole. Look! What is it? Look at the dolphin! The dolphins? Yeah! <laughs> Alright, so. This is where you sit. And bear in mind there's no shade when you do come. 
Yeah, and this is the dolphin show. Dolphins generate all their sounds through their nose, which is that hole that they have on their head and that we call a blowhole. Si guardan ustedes mucho silencio, podrán escuchar lo que no matar a Pulito tienen que decir. <laughs> Look at this one. Enjoying it, Charlie. What are they doing? Yeah. Are you going to get them to jump? What did you do to get them to jump? You got like that? <laughs> oh, here he is. Over there. Oh, he's coughing on. <laughs> Charlie, what are you doing? Are you a dolphin? No, no you're Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, look at this. So people come along and get their pictures with this thing. So now in one of them, uh, the main restaurant, I think it is the main restaurant actually. Um, I think this is where you would come if you're going to do the country and western night, where they have live entertainment, etc. etc. Um, we'll take a look. We've got a mechanical bull you can have a go on. And we got this is like the stage. Mm, you can... Sophie's doing her little routine. Not dancing. <laughs> She's walking Noah around the room to try and get him to sleep. Right, so that's the end of uh, Rancho, Texas. So we've just got in the car, kids are in the car. It's um, been a really nice day. Yeah, it? that's been a really nice boys. day. You enjoying it, nice boys? Day. Yeah. yeah, good boy. So, um, what you can do is you can uh, book, you have to book on a day, which is a bit annoying, but you can book to come again. And it's, return day. And it's 50% off, which I do recommend. Um, if you're having good weather as well. So this morning, we for, we was going to bring our swimming stuff because we know there's a water park, as you can see on the video. Um, but it was so cold and windy and overcast, we thought that it was going to be like yesterday where yeah. it was windy, cold, overcast and raining all day. Yeah. So I thought, oh, there's no point lugging it about. And then we've come here and it's brilliant sunshine. Absolute really warm. What does it say? It says 25. Yeah, 25. Not a cloud in the sky now. I think I burnt my face. It feels a bit tight. <laughs> so tip one 
take your swimming trunks. Just in case. You never know. It's a good water park, there's Looks loads really of slides, good. bits mm. and pieces. Yeah, so definitely take your swimming stuff. We got um, a nice little photo, seven euros this was, of Jack with the uh, sea lion. It was massive, absolutely ginormous. I've yeah. never seen a sea lion that big before. Yeah, it was crazy. And uh, we got a fridge magnet for my dad. Um, I think we've got two teddies. So we've got an iguana. Show me your teddies, boys. So what's this one? This is a Komodo dragon. Yeah. And we got an iguana. I don't know if Charlie's going to let you shoot. Oh, we are. We are. This one. <laughs> Sing the song, oh, Charlie. Sing the song. Iguana, iguana, and iguana. Flippy, flappy, make me happy. Iguana, iguana, and iguana. They was 19.50 each. That's quite pricey. Uh, yeah. So all in all, I spent so a photo fridge magnet, magnet, two teddies was 50 pound or oh, 50 euros 50. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't get anything for Noah again. But yeah. Yeah, what do it's you what get? it is. Yeah, but yeah, definitely recommend that if you come to Lanzarote and you want to do something with the kids. Um, it was 90 quid for us all to get in, around 90 quid, so about 80 pounds. Um, but like I say, if you come back and you do the half price return, it's, it's quite a good deal. So, yeah, yeah, it was really good. Yeah, good day. So thanks for watching, don't forget to like, share and subscribe um, and comment down below if you've been before, let us know what you thought of it or comment down below if you've got any other tips that we didn't think of for other people. Mm. See you next time, bye! bye. Alright so we've arrived in Porto del Carmen um, and we're going to go for something to eat in a steak restaurant that we like. So this car park behind us is just um, near the Dino Golf and the main shopping centre in Porto del Carmen um, on the hill, that's where we like to park because it's free. Um, it's a bit dusty and a bit roady, but it's free, so that's where we park. Um, but yeah, we'll take you along, show you where we like to go for a steak. Right, so this is where in Porto del Carmen I'm talking about, if, for those of you that have never been here. So just behind me there, you can see the post office. Um, and then behind that is the police station. And then, You've got the McDonald's here, which is probably on contest with one of the best views of McDonald's you've ever seen. And then you've got this, which is the shopping center that I was talking about. So this shopping center, um, it's quite a good shopping center actually. It's got all sorts of different things. It's got little bits and pieces for the kids up there on the uh, roof terrace there. Um, it's got nice bars. It's actually got a sky cinema up there as well, like an open air cinema. Um, like I said, it's got the Dino Golf right at the top. But yeah, nice little plaza to go and have a little mooch around shops if that's what you like doing. Um, Sophie likes doing that. I don't particularly like looking around the shops, but I don't mind going for a little coffee. And yeah, just over there is Port del Carmen. Um, we're going to the old town of Port del Carmen, which is down the bottom of the hill here. Um, yeah, on the way to the steak restaurant.